good morning happy Sunday we recorded a video back in September last year uh, not long after we arrived back from our trip overseas with the intent to do a walk through the next day um, it's now the 20th of February so uh, that worked out well that worked out quite well so <laughs> but here we are uh, never say never and uh, better better done than not so um, just what we've done on the place, we'll start from the outside and then we'll walk through the house. Uh, we've put pavers over the existing concrete jalan, the, the access into the into the bike shed. Concrete wasn't really working for us, so it was just it was always just an interim measure. We've um, put a whole lot of pebble down, so we've got a pebble garden here now with some pavers. Uh, we've now got a gate on the bike shed, which is pretty cool. We've planted five really nice red palms along the side here. Um, we've got a proper <laughs> side gate access into the into the front of the or the back of the property now as well. So we can lock this gate so from the gate from the, inside. from the inside and from the outside. It looks like there's um, there's no handle or anything. So yeah, it looks it looks pretty, and we can yeah we can lock it off, which is good. Yeah. Uh, we'll move inside. So here are the palms that we planted. There we go. Okay, let's go inside. Put a drainage system along the side here. Catch the water coming in from the terrace as a drain. Um, it runs off in the corner down there and then the water runs underground down into the jungle. That was... Um, Nice little job that we needed to get done. Yep. We've also had the entryway tiled. We've now got um, beautiful ceramic tiles on the floor here, and we've started to put some panelling on the internal entryway walls to define the area between the entryway and the workshop. There's also another beautiful red palm tree here in the centre. So between the office and the kitchen, uh, which you can see from the glass walkway and we've also filled this area here with a lot of pebbles so when the rain comes down from the roof it actually now just hits the pebbles and goes into the ground so nice and clean all right so coming inside got some new light fittings in as well we've got a couple of lights over what will be the the uh the office desk it's got one single entryway light here now as well. This will be clad in something else at some point with some nice pictures on it, but we'll get there eventually. <laughs> we finally realised our plan with the, the two elevated glass walkways. This is the first of the two, this one, um, and then we've got another one down between the bedroom. They made a huge difference to the livability of the house. Previously, it was Every time it would rain, everything would get wet. You could sort of barely walk through here without getting your feet wet. So putting these in has been a real game changer. And we, um, we love them. They look fantastic. Still need a bit of finishing. They still need to be sanded and varnished yet. But that's... Um, That'll be my job. And this job <laughs> later on. Yeah, so coming inside the kitchen now. So we haven't probably changed a whole lot here. Um, it's just a little bit more homely. We've got some new high chairs on the kitchen bench. Um, we've got some beautiful lamps. I think they were already here earlier in the year, but um, well, yeah. The last walkthrough that we did was in May, then yeah, probably. probably yeah, not, so you guys so. probably haven't really seen the house finished at all yet. This is no. actually <laughs> the first real walkthrough yeah. as a complete home. So dining table, some chairs. Um, we've got a nice sideboard here with some bits and pieces. We've got some comfy lounge chairs, a cowhide, coffee table. So just the usual things that you would have in a home. Make it nice and comfortable. My little plant selection. We've got some, yeah, we've got some more plants around the place as well, which is really nice. Yeah, that's the second walkway here. So you can actually now walk to the back of the property um, in two different ways. So you can either come through the outside deck, which is here, or you can walk through the lounge room straight into the bedroom through the second enclosed glass walkway. So I'll do that now. I'll walk through 
Okay, and then we come into the bedroom. So do you want to talk us through what's happened here? Yeah, so we we had one design in place at one point, which um, we weren't 100% happy with. So we, we that was mainly around the, the bed head and the, the frame framing of the area above the bed head. Um, we've taken that away and renewed it. So this is all new. This is a, a new design in the bed head. There'll be a rattan screen which will go across the top here of the so you won't be able to see into the into the wardrobe but it'll still allow airflow through we're still going to do some paneling same as the bed head the, the timber which we used on the bed head will go along both of these walls yeah so where you can see the exposed plywood at the yeah. moment that's going to be nice timber paneling there yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's, it's working brilliantly. We have heaps of airflow through here, which is great. We, we run the fan most of the time. We have the fan on at night, helps control the mosquitoes a little bit, which is, which is great for Anna. They tend to yeah, they love me. like to feast on her. Yeah. Um, into the backyard area now as well. We've progressed a fair bit with the, the barbecue area. We started to do the ravine across the bathroom here. Um, so this is going to be the same style of ravine as in the front. So just a massive pebble bed that's essentially going to catch the rainwater that comes from the roof here. This is our barbecue area. So we've got some beautiful timber shutters at the back for privacy. And there's still, there's still a space for kind of like a, a window or something that we can open if we do a grill and it's getting a little smoky. Um, we've got our fairy lights up. I think you would have already seen them. Our banana tree is going absolutely off its brain. It's huge. <laughs> no bananas yet, though. No bananas. And yeah, in the garden, we haven't changed too much. We've just added a couple of smaller yellow palm trees, which are probably a little bit difficult to see. And mm. But yeah, it's, it's looking really good. The grass is greening up. Um, good coverage with the grass now as well it was predominantly pretty well mud previously so yeah we're getting some getting some growth of the grass which is good yeah um so there you have it really about it at this stage obviously it's still a, a work in progress but uh, probably from the last video and you would have seen that it, it's it's come a long way I think we sort of probably lost track of what we had done back then and what we we're at where we're at now so clean slate we'll do some more regular updates from now on yeah keep you updated yeah. in terms of the progress on the place um yeah we've got some other projects in the hop as well so they're um <laughs> lots to do occupied. okay thank you for watching and until next time see you guys bye